In this video, I'm going to show you just a basic, real quick, simple increase and decrease. So we have some single crochet right here. And if we want to just increase slightly, we would simply work two stitches into one stitch and then work across the fabric. That adds one stitch to that row. Now, increases can be worked in the middle of the row. Simply two stitches into one stitch, the beginning of the row or the end of the row. Now, let's say you want to decrease a stitch. So instead of just skipping over a stitch, I guess that's one way to do it to give a more clean look to your project. What you would do is insert your hook, pull up, and instead of doing a final pull through, insert into the next stitch and pull up. Now you have three loops on your hook, one final pull through, and we've taken two stitches and turned it into one stitch. That is a simple decrease. Now, if you'd like to go ahead and do a decrease in any other style or an increase in any other style, let's say a double crochet, you would do the same thing. Increase, simply work two stitches into one, or for the double crochet to decrease, yarn over, insert hook, pull up, pull through two, yarn over, insert hook, pull up, pull through two, and pull through the final pull through all three loops. Okay, so you're left with one stitch up top to be worked into the next row instead of two. And that's it. That's how you can create shaped items in crochet.